But school not guys, T-Mart here, and I wanted to make this video as a forewarning for the NBA 2K17 tirade that is about to take over this channel. I am seriously so excited. We are just a few hours away from the release of 2K17, and it's going to be crazy. I'm really looking forward to it. So uh, if you pre-ordered, you get the early tip-off edition, which unlocks tonight at midnight Eastern time. So that's what I'm going to start playing, recording, and uploading for you guys. We'll probably have a couple videos go up late tonight, and then the rest will go up. I'm thinking pretty much all NBA all weekend, honestly. Like, we're still going to have a Super Cooper Sunday and maybe a couple GTA episodes, but I'm really thinking about hitting NBA hard out of the gate just because... Obviously, my player career is such a, a huge thing. Like, it did so well last year. You guys loved it last year. I, just, I think it'd be awesome to really hit the, the, the ground running. You know what I mean? Like, come out of the gate strong. I think that'd be pretty cool. Honestly, I'm kind of bummed. So, this is how serious I'm taking it. Yesterday, I saw a post on eBay for 200 bucks, And the guy said he'd overnight it so you could have it a day early. And I did it. I bought it for 200 bucks. It's like, you know what? I could get it this afternoon. I could play. I could have like eight videos ready to go right at midnight for these guys. It'd be awesome. Well, it ends up that the guy accidentally didn't ship it via overnight. He shipped it yesterday. So it should have got here. But he didn't tell them to ship it overnight. So I'm tracking it, and it's like, nope, it's not going to be there today. It'll be there tomorrow. And I'm, I'm so upset about it. I'm going to try to get a refund and that sort of thing. But, uh, you know, I guess I'm just going to have to grind it out with you guys at midnight. And uh, we'll see how that goes. So I'm super excited about that. I just want to let you guys know, it's going to be a bit of NBA spam this weekend. We are going to get back to everything else we regularly do, all the Madden and MLB and stuff like that. But uh, just know... It's going to be a lot of NBA coming up. It's exciting. I can't wait. It's going to be a fun weekend. Now, NBA isn't the only major release coming out here very, very soon. Forza Horizon 3, my friends. We just played the demo not too long ago, and uh, that thing is quickly approaching. So the game comes out on the 27th. If you pre-order it, you get it four days early on the 23rd. And I don't know how much I could say, but I'm going to be uploading before that. So just be ready for that. It's going to be very, very soon. I've been having a lot of fun in the demo that I've been playing. And uh, I think you guys are really, really going to enjoy that series as well. Obviously, Forza Horizon 2 was the bomb.com when we played it. And I can't wait to start uploading this one as well for you guys. So that should be coming up soon. Those are going to be two huge new series we're going to be starting within the next week or so, which is just incredibly exciting. And I can't wait. Now... Talking about that, I've got to have some real talk with you guys, all right? So, when we add new series, obviously sometimes old series have to go. And I really hate ending games in the middle of a series. Like, I, I, I've only done it with a couple of games before, and I, I just, like, I feel like once I start something, I should finish it, for those people who like that series. And it's, it's not about the views, it's more about the reception, you know what I mean? Like, if something is getting fewer views than other series, I'm not only going to cancel it because of that, I'm going to cancel it because the reception isn't quite as good as it once was. And there are two series out there right now who I'm kind of feeling that way about, and I think you guys are going to know what I'm talking about. One is Deus Ex, and the second is No Man's Sky. So Deus Ex is the least viewed series on the channel right now, and like I said, that's fine. As long as people are enjoying it, Sometimes it gets decent ratings, sometimes not so much. It just, it kind of feels like people don't have that much interest in it. And I can't decide what to do with that series. If you guys want me to keep it, I want you guys to leave comments down below. If you guys want me to keep it, I'll just upload it like either super early in the morning or super late at night. So it's not like a mainstream series that's like in the middle of the day. And we'll, we'll replace it with something else in the middle of the day. You know what I mean? So let me know if you guys like want more of that or not. I don't know. I, just, I feel like interest has been kind of waning for that. For No Man's Sky... I've pretty much decided that we're going to stop playing that game. I was enjoying it. It's a fun, chill-out game, but I can understand why people don't like watching it that much. And I was looking it up. So the, the whole goal of No Man's Sky is to get to the center of the universe. And supposedly that takes, on average, about 30 hours. So that's about 30 hours of aimlessly flying from planet to planet, mining and talking to stones. You know what I mean? Like, that just... That does, it doesn't sound like that much fun. So I, I just... I, I don't know. That has the worst ratings out of every series on this channel. It actually gets decent views still, but I just, I think, I think part of the problem is that I got started so late on it because I was in Michigan when the game came out, so it was hard to record. And then part of it is, it's not really a game for YouTube videos. It's more of a game for live streams. And I want to start doing more live streams, 
and I, I totally plan on doing that in the near future. But it's just like, it's one of those games where when you sit down for a 20 minute episode, you aren't gonna get much done. You need to sit down for like three or four hours and grind it out. And if I would have done it like that, we probably would have got through it. But because it's like typical Let's Play format, 20 to 30 minute episodes, just not much happens and it's just really slow. So like with 30 hours of gameplay, I'd be like 80 episodes of walking around and mining. Like I, just, I, I don't think that's a good idea. People haven't really been liking it lately and I think we are gonna cut that one out. So I'm just letting you guys know, no more No Man's Sky. I feel really bad about it. I was actually kind of enjoying the game because it was so chill, but I just, I feel like there's other stuff we can replace it with. We can do more of what we're doing already. So obviously we're doing GTA on the weekends, we're doing Madden, we're doing MLB, we're doing all that kind of stuff. Um, we've also got some DLC we need to finish up. So we have the Sea Heist DLC for Just Cause 3 that we haven't done yet. We've got uh, episode 4 of The Walking Dead Michonne from Telltale Games. We have episode 2 of Batman from Telltale Games coming out on September 20th, which is really exciting. Um, and that's pretty much it for like DLC and stuff. There's also some other stuff I want to start up. I was thinking about starting up a Pokemon Fire Red Let's Play. So let me know if you guys think I'm crazy for that, but I thought that'd be kind of fun. I definitely want to play Sun and Moon when it comes out later this year. I'm going to be honest, I haven't played Pokemon since Sapphire and Ruby, so it's been a while and I'm gonna be kind of a noob when that comes out, but I thought it'd be fun to start with Fire Red, we'll beat that, play Sun and Moon, and then go through and maybe play all the other Pokemon games if we like them. Obviously, Pokemon Go has been a huge hit on this channel. It's kind of reinvigorated my love for Pokemon, and I'd love to do that. So let me know what you guys think. And uh, there's some other things I wanna do. Obviously, I just got the new racing wheel, so we could check stuff out like iRacing that we played earlier this morning. Um, we could check out, I think, Forza 6 has a NASCAR DLC, which sounds pretty cool. We could kind of check that out. Um, and there are other racing games out there we could play too. And there's also stuff I want to do with Chelsea. So I've talked about doing like Wii games with Chelsea, Disney Infinity with Chelsea. Uh, I really want to do like uh, Sims 4 Let's Play with her. I think that'd be kind of funny. Or even, what's that one game? It's like dating Ariana or something, like a dating simulator game that's like super raunchy. That would be, I don't want to talk about it because she's out there. I don't want to hear it. I, just, I think that'd be hilarious. So we could do that. Uh, I was also thinking about doing a YouTuber's Life Let's Play. Uh, that looks like a pretty fun game, and I don't know, there's just, there's a bunch of stuff we could do. There's a lot of stuff I want to get creative with and, and kind of start new stuff up. And then we have a huge Q4 coming up with like Battlefield and Call of Duty and Dishonored and all these other games. So it's going to be awesome and I can't wait, but we need to kind of free up some space. So let me know what you guys think about that. Long story short, I think we're going to end No Man's Sky. Let me know what you guys think about Deus Ex. And uh, that's kind of what we're doing. So get ready for a ton of NBA this weekend. It's going to be absolutely insane. I can't wait. And uh, I'm going to see you guys in our first NBA video tonight at midnight. Or probably like 12.30 or 1 o'clock. Because I have to play it, then I have to render it, then I have to upload it. So it'll be a little bit later. But to make sure you guys are there. I'll catch you guys later. Peace out.